Hi everyone, this time I will show you how to knit a graphic into your work. And for this, I prepared a graphic chart. Um, for this, you can use the software Knit Pro 2.0. I will post a link into the description. And we will have a look at the W. So I will show you how to knit the W and I have here 26 stitches I cast it on 26 stitches and this is the first row and these are 26 squares yeah I think it is you can call this squares okay so the first row is white as you can see and for this, I will purl the row because you should only add a new color if you're knitting. So if you do the knit row. And for this, we will purl the first row. And then I will show you how to add the color and how to knit your graphics. So this is my first row. I purled it. Now we'll have a look at our graphic. So the first row, I purled it in this direction. So this was the first row. The second row, we will knit it in this direction. So first we have to count here how many white stitches we have. This one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. And then we have two black and one gray. And if you have a gray stitch, you can decide if you want to have this color or this color. So I will do, I will knit a white one here. So we have seven white stitches, two black, and then white again. So first I will knit seven stitches. Six and seven and now we will add a new color for this I have here a green one and I take the short end in this hand and the long end here and I knit it in a normal way and also the second stitch so now we have to tie this and you, you make a simple knot. Make sure that it's not too tight, otherwise it looks not nice. So you tie this and you will sew the ends later because we do not have enough of the green and you will hide it later. And now we we change to our white color and we should have a look how many stitches we need. And here we need one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, and eight. The last gray will be also white one, so we need eight. And then two black again. So eight of the white. So I take my white yarn. And I need one stitch first and then I will have a look at my at my yarn here and make sure that the tension is not too high otherwise it will look not nice so the first and seven more second third four five Seven, 
and eight. And then we have two of the other color. So we grab the other color and knit, knit one stitch. Then have a look on your at your tension. So this should be okay, and then we can continue doing this. So we have the second, and here we change again. So we grab the white one, knit one, have a look at your tension, and then knit the other stitches. So this is the second row and we will have a look at the third. So first, whoops, first we, we had this direction, the second row was this direction and the third row will be this direction. So we have here one, two, three, four, five, six stitches, six white stitches, and four black. And we turn our our work because we are working in the stockinette stitch. We need to purl. So first, I purl six stitches. Six, and now we turn the color or we change the color and we need four stitches with the green yarn so you purl the first and you have a look at your tension this should be okay I think and then three more And then we come back to our white yarn and we have here one, two, three, six white stitches and four black again. So I need six stitches, but first only three. One, two, three. So do I, I do not need I pearl, sorry. This is the pearl stitch. And now you can you can grab the the black yarn or the green here and put the white again over the green so it will be fixed at this point and it's better afterwards for the tension and then you purl three more And switch to the green color again. Pearl four or the first one, then have a look at your tension. And then three more. Now we can switch to the the white yarn, pearl one, have a look at your tension, and then pearl all the other stitches. Then this is how to knit graphics. So you can see here, this is the beginning of, of our W.